Edward J. Emerson, and it is May of 1932. And May is the month that we redesign our electric vehicles, or we design our electric vehicles for the upcoming years. And we decided to take a look at the electric vehicles and just to see whether or not if we're in line. Majority of our electric vehicles are pretty pricey. When they're pricey only in comparison to the petrol vehicles with similar performance in a way because our vehicles are heavily torque bound light in the horsepower category that held true for majority of our vehicles and even still some of our vehicles as time has gone on some of our petrol vehicles have gotten lighter in weight while our electric vehicles pretty much kind of stayed the same we ventured off into a sub-brand for electric, which is EcoSport, and our main brand is Emerson Electric, headquartered in Detroit, Michigan, and we manufacture in Detroit, Michigan. We have a second factory in Brazil, and then the EcoSport is manufactured in Colombia. We were looking at just comparing electric market. We decided to take the approach, even though we had lost a considerable amount of money on a lot of our first designs. We decided that since we have some more profitable divisions, that we were going to stick around with the electric. What's happening now is that the petrol vehicles actually funded our electric vehicles. Very few models that turned a profit. We needed to look at just how to spin this brand off and not necessarily be a hindrance to the other sister brands that it actually has. We wanted to be able to become more efficient in our approach. Part of that is becoming more of a global entity. So we sell a lot of vehicles in Europe, in Japan, in a lot of the outside areas, but inside of the United States, we don't sell that many, even though majority of the employees that make the electric vehicles are in the city of Detroit. We've been decreasing some of the prices over time to get them more in line with some of the other vehicles that are at this time. Like, for instance, Columbia's vehicle's price is $4,000. We're staying right around in that price range because we have comparable performance. We have comparable size. Some of their vehicles are a little bit lighter than our vehicles. Looking at that, we ended up looking for a lighter platform. And even though we're not that far off, what we want to do also is further decrease our weight in our vehicles anywhere possible. We just updated from the manual transmission to an automatic transmission. And with that going from the manual to the automatic, we gained about 100 pounds. So we needed to look at where we could lose that 100 pounds and more. We started looking at frames and engines. Our frames, about 75 to 100 pounds savings, weight savings, without losing the performance. The majority of our vehicles are selling with an air suspension, which, as you already know, is a very heavy system. We chose that route because our customers are getting something that is borderline luxury, but far from 
economic. They're paying a premium for these vehicles. So we wanted to give them something a little bit different than you would get in your regular vehicles. And our regular vehicles are running your standard suspension system. So we chose to go with the suspension system that we utilize in our luxury brand, which is Emerson Allure. Also, we were utilizing in our top luxury performance brand, Emerson Grande. With looking at all of this, we did realize that we are offering a lot more horsepower than a lot of our competitors. Our competitors are running anywhere between five to nine horsepower, average speeds of about 24 to 25 miles per hour. So we wanted to take our vehicles, which have an average speed of about 30 miles per hour, horsepower of 18. We are going from 18 horsepower up to 32 horsepower for our standard. We're in extreme in certain areas where our competition is going for more mileage, making about half the miles that they are making. But that's for our standard vehicles and for our performance vehicles. What is the advantage of our performance vehicles is the higher top speed. The range stays just about the same. We just decided that we were going to take a look at Emerson Electric. Each May, we decide that we are going to look at what our product stack is. And currently we're offering a compact sedan, a coupe, a mid-size vehicle, a truck. We just got finished developing an all-electric SUV of a shooting brake, a luxury sedan, a town car, and we have a van.